peace, love and centeredness. Every single video will generally always start in that way. I'm not actually breathing in air anymore. When I go outside and it's raining, which it is at the minute, and there's no sunlight in any way, shape or form, it's now very, very exciting for me because now I'm actually pulling in the 0, 0 0.5 hydrogen gas that resides within the air along with the uh, amino acid hydrogen, the carbon um, of amino acid, the nitrogen of, am of amino acid. So all four of those, which we call the con, yeah, I'm actually able to pull those in now because what I've done is increased my internal uh, energy level, which has increased my field strength, which has grown my auric field. If I was to explain that to some people, they would say, you're talking rubbish. And the reason that they would say that is because it is known information, the, 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 the beans that pass the information down, uh, ma magicians, darker magicians, black magicians, whatever, sorcerers, occultists, dark occultists, whatever you want to call them, but they are still occultists, right? They, they understand the psychology of the human um, mind. So they, they understand that by giving you a small amount of knowledge, you, we perceive that small amount of knowledge to be the grand all. That's how our minds work. So when we are, the, we, we are only working with a limited amount of information, a limited amount of knowledge. And then that limited amount of knowledge that we, that we then work with, what happens is, like I was just saying, we, we actually perceive that we know the, to the totality of, of all that there is to know based on our level of understanding. That is how we do it. What we don't realise, what we don't realise is, is that all is actually transmutable. All is transmutable and all things operate on different planes, which are operating on different frequencies. And there are many, many, many of them. And they operate like different TV channels, different, different channels. So what actually happens is, because we base everything on the, the one channel, which is a limited channel that we are on, with the limited perspective and the limited amount of knowledge, yeah? What we then do, we enter the world of moral relativism, where we start to become the arbiter of truth. We start to define and, and be the ruler of, of what we define as truth. So then what happens is, we then encase our reality, we limit our, our, our perspectives, and we limit our reality. It is like a remote control. You are the controller of a game that has multiple levels, but you, we don't, we don't realise this. We don't realise this because we are only operating with a very small amount of knowledge. That very small amount of knowledge that we operate by gives us a scarcity-based perspective, which gives us a limited perspective, which means that we're only able to, able to operate on a small bandwidth frequency. Yeah, and then through that, we then base all of the new incoming information that we see on that small amount of knowledge that we own, that we have. And because of that, we never come to an understanding of deeper levels of truth. And that is one of the main issues um, that, we, that, that we face with all of, all of humanity. Yeah, that is how it is. Yeah, and then your, your, your false ego aligns with that. Yeah, and then it aligns with your lower, lower, um, this lower seven, yeah, emotional senses that are energetic, like seven metals. We have seven spirits of the throne, but we also have seven metals at the same time. Those seven, me the metals have to be transmuted, yeah, into, into spirit. When they're in that metal state, we are, you are in the transverse wave effect, finite, temporal and imperfect and animalistic yeah that is the basis of 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 being i'm going to be explaining that and i will show that on this with this here yeah this is what we, we, we'll be looking at um also i wanted to, to say and state that we are now working with free energy this presentation will be dedicated to nikola tesla yeah genius genius there's nobody here that c can reach the level of, of the mind of Nikola Tesla. Yeah. He stayed in room 3327. 
just like myself, the, the, the 69, the 369 follows me around like crazy. I've got so many, po at the minute I have like a catalogue, like last month, the 144 and the 6s and the 9s, etc. Just, just follow me around, like I've got a catalogue of images and stuff like that that I can show. Um, so I'm basing this um, on Tesla, right? Now, the reason I'm saying that, his greatest discovery, not his invention, his, his words, was the, the rotating magnetic field, yeah? And he stated that, that the, the discovery of the rotating magnetic field uh, and, and introduces us to new superior forces and phenomena that we, did not, we could not previously um, see. <coughs> and he's, the reason he, sat, he, he, he states clearly that that is the, the biggest, the most massivest, and this was in the 1800s, his discovery will go on past science. The day when so, the, so, science will never, ever, ever be able to, to, to amass anything like the magnetic field. They won't be able to do that. And they've hidden the magnetic field from you and, in, and encased and called things particles, um, electron particles, um, photons, light photons, this and that. This particle, that particle, creating films and talking about particles, etc., bouncing off each other and all sorts, deliberately to hide magnetism. And the reason that that is the case is because magnetism works in a very, very uh, magical but simplistic way. Yeah, what it does is it has a two end mo uh, modality. So what it will always do, it has, re it will repel, it will repel energy. Yeah. And it will also have a dielectric acceleration, yeah, which is, they call that the gravitational, yeah. So it will pull away. And what it does, what it does is it, it's, it's, it repels energy from its source. What is its source? Perfection. What it then does is it then, dielect dielectric acceleration, it then pulls away, away, it takes away what isn't required, sends that back to the source, which is counter space, that gets recycled, unmanifest. You see, space has no properties. Unmanifest, yeah, outside of this realm, counter space, perfection. It then gets recycled and renewed again, yeah. <clears throat> that had to be hidden in order for this game to be played. The reason it had to be hidden in order for this game to be played, because otherwise we'd be in a state of imperfection and we wouldn't be able to play the, the, a, a game of... A game of climbing out of deep adversity, deep imperfection, yeah, to rise up to perfection. Like at this moment in time, the you that like I said, like I've been stating, plasma creates rain. Plasma is is incoming, right? So here where I reside, it's heavy, heavy rain. I was going to do a post the other day explaining that those in body sensation, which we're gonna to see today, we they, they become they are depressed by the weather. They are depressed by the initial five senses. Everything that they see in the, the five senses, so when material objects, etc., they buy into them, they look into them, yeah? But the, the only issue is they're never going to get total happiness out of a material object. Why is that? Because the things that you look at, you become used to them. <laughs> you become used to them. So that's why you have to keep replacing them so they know exactly what, what they're doing. And you're, you're using the limited amount of knowledge. It's all based on that limited, limited perspective and that limited amount of knowledge that we have at the same time also. Yeah. So what, what, I'm, what I'm saying is, 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 is this. When I go outside into the rain, and it's, it's deeply raining, and it's, there's no sunshine because the sun is gone now. The sun is going to die, and the sun is dying now as we move towards the 21st. But when I go out, the air for me now is filled with a fuel. It is filled with a fuel. I will also be showing how you can mix plasma, how we mix plasma, water, air, CO2 and hydrogen to create free energy, a fuel. Moving on to free energy, I am not buying a machine and plugging anything in. We're using magnetism and creating magnetic fields with no plug sockets, no buying of hardly any materials, a very small amount of cost. That's it. Very, very minimal. Very, 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 very minimal cost, yeah? And it is generating its own energy, yeah? So when you see the plate and you can see 
all of the, you can see there's the, the white that's attached to the plate, the GANs that's attached to the plate, where you can see that the energy, there's energy there because the plate, the, this, the, the zinc plate, you can see it, it's covered in a white sheet now where you can see it's been generating some sort of, some type of energy. It is, we are doing that using creating free energy now. Free, free energy. Yeah. The GANs of plasma, it, it has contains like 20, 30 superconductors, even just a small amount. When you've got lots and lots of them, you can power a car, you can power a laptop, you can power anything with it, yeah? But we remember, we have been using our limited perspective, our limited amount of knowledge, and that gives us moral relativism, where we become the arbiter of truth, yeah? We, truth is not subjective to your own personal opinion. It, there is an objective truth that resides with that within nature. So... This means that when I'm explaining and saying that you can come and energy come, my next video, the next presentation is going to be called around, so, uh, around the compounding of energy. Yeah. <clears throat> and to do with the half, which we'll, we'll go into that. Yeah. So the, the, this is the, the basis of everything. So en energy, which is what I state, which is what I state. Yeah. Is unlimited. Yeah. It's the, the levels are unlimited. It goes on and on and on and on and on. Yeah, this is how it works, right? You access superior planes that that they are aligned with energy. Tesla teaches some that was taught say like some of the same things as I state here. I I with the works of some, something like Tesla over the years. And I've not just focused on Tesla being an inventor, blah, blah, blah. I focus on tes Tesla being an, an adept um, initiate who, who practices self-mastery. That's what he, what he does. Yeah, he, he recognises that. And he stated clearly that energy is a, is a trigger for high levels of consciousness. Your high levels of consciousness are directly interconnected to, to energy. Yeah, there's a direct correlation and connection to um, to that so no matter where you reside on this plane if you are able to plug in to these supreme superior superior forces yeah then what happens is then that with the control pad with the control pad yeah through action actioning other processes as well action is born out of wisdom yeah you are able to change the tv channel regardless to your adverse situation so even in if there was a flood scenario or whatever it was, I am still going to reside in a state of bliss. It is based on your emotional state. Yeah, that would let you know that, yes, you are activating um, soul. Yeah, and they, 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 we know that death does not exist. So these, these high levels of energy introduce you to, towards your more immortal state. Yeah, so th this is coming from your more immortal state. Look, what, what is this? What is, what is this? Is this water? Yes, it is water. Water is four. A lot of my insightful um, syncretic knowledge, I use the language of Adam and Eve to do that. And their, their alphabet had 22 um, letters in it. Yeah, and 22 is the number of our mother. And you are approaching 22. 22 is a number for volt, for voltage. Her voltage, when her voltage increases, this is when the plasma sparks start to start to appear. This is re all real stuff. You can do this. You can create. You can create voltage charge to do to to, to do this with wires, and you can increase the voltage charge, and then the uh, electro electrostatic discharge then comes through, and that gives you plasma tentacles. Yeah. So this here is water, but it is Christic water. And it is water that has been created by recycling, reciprocating my magnetism. That's what this is. So when I drink this, it is filled with uh, God amino acids that remove addiction, that, that send and that control the electrotransport chain to the heart, yeah, yeah, that re re removes the, uh, the high levels of glucose that are within the system, yeah, that calms the mind, removes depression, all sorts, all sorts, 
And this is only in its non. This hasn't been transmuted yet. See, because this will now gain a magnetic field. And when it gains that magnetic field, it will increase in its strength by over 500 times. Yeah. Uh, so even the, 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 if, if I was drinking this from, from birth, then your hair and everything would be absolutely perfect because of the silicia that is inside it. So between the GABA, the taurine, the silicia, the, some of the aminos, like the, the taurines, it does so many things. When I go to explain it, I'm just like, well, watch, which bit shall I say? What shall I actually say? When you increase this, it will activate new brain cells in your brain when you are using it in the correct manner. Yeah. So, the, the, and then one of the other things is, is, is this. The nature is relying upon us, yeah, to access the fields, yeah. Not just for us, but for the animals and plant life also, yeah. Because the animals and the plants, you see, yeah, that when we, when we, the, the vegetation grows, when you spray CO2 on plants, they explode and they grow. And then weaker plants, because their field shrinks increases, they then start to fix the weaker that's around them. This is what fields do. It's how fields do. And it's this, the same then with, with animals as well, yeah. The feeding of animals, yeah, we're able to di disinfect air and right, to disinfect and remove all sorts which we are going to see which we are going to see as i uh, go through this this video this, this presentation now right so what you have here what we have here is the seven is seven these are the seven spirits of the throne which is what they are yeah, so with these seven spirits of the throne, yeah, you also have the seven metals. Those seven metals are in alignment with the transverse electrical wave effect, which is only finite and temporal, temporary, yeah, and it is based. In, it's based, yeah, it's based in an up and down fashion. Yeah, these are them here, this side. Based in an up and down fashion. Good, bad, good, bad, good, bad, good, bad. Yeah, this is how it works. Happy, hell. Yeah, so when you, this is, this is all a, a part of this, realm deliberately because electricity is only a hybrid of the far superior forces which reside which stem from a causal pulse which is a longitudinal ah yeah this what i'm explaining when i explain this in, in, a, in a scientific level yeah it can be found yeah um there was tesla and steinmetz etc when they the these are geniuses, real scientific geniuses. They had to be quite enough, right? Because they were working with the true forces, yeah? Not, not electrical par particles and stuff. They work with magneto. They, the forces are dielectricity, magneto dielectricity, yeah? Dielectrics, these are superior forces, yeah? And then the, the forces that come from the, the plasma, yeah? They are, and the, the dielectric field, yeah? They create modalities, so more than one thing is happening at once. Yeah, but they stem from a a a a a, a superior constant force, which is constantly in a state of perfect bliss. That's how it how it works. Which is why when we align ourselves, and then we when we eat. You eat so you eat bad foods, etc. They are they have that electrical effect to them. But what happens is, is they align with other transverse wave movements, like the lustful sex, like the getting angry. Yeah, you will you will do if you eat certain sugars, etc. Which will I'm going to show you here now. You'll see. Yes, yeah, so you eat certain certain foods, certain GMO, certain glyphosate, etc. 
It angers your DNA. It angers, it angers because you are working with this transverse wave effect, which is aligned with the cause and effect. And the reason it's aligned with the cause and effect is to there to, to teach you so that you can learn to become uh, an activated soul through uh, through action, yeah, which will lead you towards wisdom, which is which would be the, the, the center point here, yeah. Which is why I did another presentation, um, yeah, uh, um, yesterday because I was at this one had to be delayed, and and I forgot to mention a gentleman on there mentioned the word harm, which is on one of my boards anyway. And I always speak about the H, don't I? Which we know because I do. I broke it down the H, and he was saying that harm and harmonious. Why are they? Why is one negative and one's one's a positive? Because they reside. And I, I forgot to mention the reason it's like that is because they reside within the H, yeah. And within the H contains the illusion of the good and the bad. It's like an Ouroboros here, yeah. So it has heaven and hell, yeah. The H is. And you have to work with the heaven and the hell. You work with the both of them, these eight, yeah? And when you recognise these in your nine, in your nine here, because you see your father, he comes down and he penetrates your mother and he's the nine, but he also oxidises as well. Why does he oxidise? Because there is no death. All must be recycled and renewed. So your rust, which we will explain here, which, which wants to kill you, in a way, yeah, which wants to kill your vessel. There is no death, remember. It wants to diminish, your, it wants to diminish the vessels, the vessels who, have not, who are not triumphant, who, have not, who are not uh, noble enough to see through the initial five senses. This is all a game. This is how our mother and father sees this. You have to be able to rise up to their levels and their standards, yeah, and play the game. That's why when you are, they are, spend lifetimes excreting this, thinking it's waste, because their initial senses and the limited amount of knowledge that was given, yeah, and the way that the the way that the human mind works perceives with its false ego, which is a, a byproduct of this realm, perceives now that it knows everything and it uses moral relativism to decide that this is a waste without doing prior and thorough investigation and full experimentation first, first hand. Yeah, and how does that happen? That happens because they, they don't action diligence. Your roots, this is why I'm using this, requires diligence, work. There is much work to be done here. So when one human being says, listen, there is these fields and they burst through your heart and they, and they, they, they accelerate your consciousness drastically, it is for the individual to use their, their own initiative and senses to see past the illusory concepts of we've been taught this and this and this and go past that in order to action it for oneself. And then once we have done that, that is when we can have, a, that is when we can speak and, and have a perspective on what is being said. Only until it is actioned. Once, if, you, if it's not actioned, you are coming from the point of assuming. The word assume is, means assume me. You make an ass out of you and me. Yeah? This is this what, I'm, what we're saying. It is action. Without action, we are speaking from the from a perspective of just um, ignorance. That is the basis of what is actually happening, right? So I just wanted to read this at the top of here as well. It says here at the top, it says, in the villa, in the villa of, or men, in the villa of, or men, stands a solitary candle. Aha, 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 aha. Aha, 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 means nine, 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 nine. Causality at the centre of all things. Your eye is the centre of, of all things. Mine's dark brown, so you can't see. But you see, the, the iris, Isis, I mean, yeah, and you see here, this black cone is pulling, sucking in the light, yeah. I'm tempted to suck in the light that could be that's there, right? The center of it all, yeah. In the center of it all, your eyes, your eyes, yeah. It's telling this is David Bowie because an occultist is trying to tell you, trying to tell you, and then they tell you that these people die, right? Right, so. In your eyes, in the centre, in your eyes, yeah? 
a clock, if you look at a clock, it is giving you this, this, this realm. The nature of this realm is constantly reflecting back the truth to you. And that's why I keep showing this, because it's reflecting back the truth to you. That you see, you these waters are to be recycled. Within them contains Christic elements that will actually lift you up, lift you up into a new place, into a new, into a new realm, yeah, into a more perfected state of being. All is to be recycled and to be renewed again. Right, so it then goes on to say, right, right, so uh, the town of the serpent people, David Bowie, the black star, black sun, the serpent people, yeah, there used to be serpent people on this earth, and they, and then the other people were scared of the serpent people, they thought they were, they thought they were superior beings and stuff, they were, and then these serpent people used to rule over, the, because of the wave, you see, the wave, you see, they used to rule over those who were less conscious because of the, the wave effect, again, Right, yeah, and they used to rule over them by these virtues here, by these virtues, because they recognised that these seven these seven metals can be turned into seven spirits, seven spirits of the throne, and 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 you see your mother and father upright down here, and when they unleash the serpent, they unleash they unleash a level of perfection that is not un, unknown to to the regular man, and it and it means that they become a far far superior being, all knowing. Yeah. And so this is why you have the seven, which is aligned with, the, you also have seven bodies at the same time as well. You also have seven bodies, which is why when you sleep, your etheric body, yep, levitates above your physical body. And that is the one that goes backwards and forwards in uh, what you call time. Yeah. And this is why you have the dreams where we go backwards and forwards. And this energy has to, the, the glucose has to remain going while you're sleeping in order for these processes to take place. Because the once you are, when you sleep, things are reflected back to you. Yeah. The, the, the nature is reflecting back experiences to you at the same time. You're still having experiences uh, while you rest and while we actually sleep. So, so then uh, now, what we will, what we will then do now is move on to the actual the actual boards. And before I do that, I just want to say that this this the Skyvians, the Skyvians, they used to uh, drink their um, they used to mess, used to drink uh, blood, blood plasma as well, right? But they also what they what they did, what the Skyvians did, is they worked with fire. They worked with fire, right? By working with and they worked with fire, and they also worship the mother as well. Shamans also work with fire as well. They work with fire uh, to to produce to 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 make uh, super advanced happenings take place in terms of healings and manipulating the weather and so on and so forth. And what is fire? What does fire lead to? Fire leads to um, to plasma. So that leads us onto the onto the next one. So we'll see you soon.